Hey everybody, DeLongshot Signatures here. This is episode 136 of my 2023 TTM Returns, and I have five successes to share with you all to start the week. First one is from a uh, former NASCAR crew chief who I have gotten from before, just adding him to uh, a couple of sets. Uh, this is a two of two success in 10 days from Doug Williams. Signed both of my 94 Max cards for the two different sets that I'm working on for that. Then we have a college football quarterback return. This is a two of two success in 73 days from University of Alabama, Birmingham uh, quarterback Jacob Zeno. He's a former Baylor University quarterback, stayed there for several seasons, including the COVID year. Uh, decided to transfer and was the starting quarterback for UAB this year. Did pretty well for himself. I think he is still uh, a uh, junior in terms of his eligibility. So I think he'll be returning to play college football next year. Next, we have a college hockey coach. This is a two of two success in 26 days from the women's ice hockey coach for the University of Minnesota, Brad Frost. Frost is a very, very accomplished head coach uh, so far, winning multiple Division I championships, like four or five, I think. Um, it was hard to get an exact count because his Wikipedia page hasn't been updated in a while. Um, but I'm pretty sure he has 10 Frozen Four appearances, which is just insane. So this guy is, you know, really pushing the team every year, uh, championship caliber, and they've won several championships. So very cool to get that. Then we have a couple of NHL goalie prospects. These guys have already been drafted but have uh, not played in an NHL ga game yet. One of them has been in the NHL but has not played yet. First one is a 2 of 2 success in 14 days from Red Wings prospect Rudy Gamond. Gremond? Not really sure how it's supposed to be pronounced. But uh, he was a draft pick from this past year. So he's got a long way ahead of him uh, in terms of making it to the NHL, but he was in their um, rookie development camp, and I think he plays in the USHL still. Next one is a 2 of 2 success, also in 14 days, from uh, St. Louis Blues prospect Vadim Jarenko. He uh, made it to the NHL last year, appearing on the bench for... Uh, one or two games um, on an emergency basis. Uh, they had some injuries, and um, he didn't make it into the game, but he has played a lot at the AHL level, and uh, I think he was drafted in 2017, so he's had some time to develop, and those um, call-ups to the AHL usually mean that you're pretty close to being the next guy up um, should injuries or performance uh, necessitate needing a new goaltender for a team. So hopefully we get to see both of these guys uh, make it and play in the NHL, but they are some just cool successes for right now. But that is it for this one. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Best luck with your guys' collecting. Take care.